gonna purify the new world? Oh. It's beautiful. Well, this looks promising. But we won't know for sure until the next step. We're gonna need five Gracidia flowers. If my research is right, they should spawn in an environment just like this one. Ah, no. Make that four. There's one right there, right? Yeah, I guess that's what they look like. Just like this one. Perhaps since these flowers are connected to Shaman, you'll find them near where the Shaman first appeared. Okay. So four more Gracidia flowers then. Could I ask you to go look for them? I'll keep an eye on the Shaman here while I keep working. You can ask me if you need some help as well. Okay. Uh, I think I remember where the, where the Shaman were. We'll go to the one with the maze first, I think. Or should we go do this one first? Let's go do this one first. I do not remember how to get there. Oh boy, it's all the way over there. What? Why is the rock blocking my way? Oh, do we have to go... I think we gotta go do a different one. Oh, this is a Psygarde cell down there. Hold on. How do I get to that? Like this. There's a rock block in our way, so we probably gotta go do a different one first. And then we'll be able to, uh... You know, somehow get that rock out of the way. Oh boy. I just wasted my time. check the maze then.
Found some soul dew. Nice. There we go. And now we can finish the last puzzle and we'll be good to go. Okay, we're done.
found them. Perfect. Using these samples, I should have enough material to synthetically cross-pollinate and produce an entire proper garden in this environment. This would normally take a while, but as long as Lumi is in stable condition, there's no need to rush. We can take our time making sure the components or the compounds we need develop properly. And she's gonna be okay. What in the fresh fires of... is this? Pardon? Oh my god, it's Crawberry! <laughs> what incarnations are all these garbage plants doing here? Uh... They grew here. Sorry, who are you? Crodberry. The name's Ignacia Crodberry, simpleton. Now wipe that moronic look off your slack-jawed face this instant, or I'll slap you stupid myself. Oh my god. I was just minding my own business on what was supposed to be a peaceful walk. What do you mean, pe- Okay, so... She decides to take a peaceful walk into somebody's house, then going into their garden, entering this new world door, and... Okay, that... Yeah, that's a peaceful walk, all right. When I notice that hulking gate of light sitting in Seacrest's stinking garden, if I'd known he was growing some kind of occult... Uh, occultist devil portal there, I would have never quit salting his earth with oh my god unauthorized occultist devil portals are clear violations of city building code I should have known that lily livered good for nothing smarmosaur would be out here risk raising ruckus again I bet he's just doing this to get back at me you know the old man oh I knew him all right Back in the day, I had old Seacrest wrapped around my finger. Wrapped around a few other things, too. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't want to hear that. <laughs> but then he ripped out my heart and... Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry I asked. Look, we're kind of in the middle of something here. Would you mind stepping aside and letting us finish? Oh, dearie. Well, why didn't you just say so? Because as a matter of fact, I would mind. If you think old Crodberry's just gonna stand aside and let you practice your arcane devil magic, well then, honey, you got a... <laughs> you got something coming. I'm gonna raise this entire putrid garden back down to the devil stone it, it's, it's grown from. And once I'm done, I'll torch the whole place until the only thing left is smoldering remains of your hopes and dreams. <laughs> oh man, dude. Honestly, I don't know who I hate more as a character in this game. Crodberry or Fern? <laughs> They're both equally awful. <laughs> Right. So. So much for taking our time growing things. Looks like we're gonna have to find a way to grow the compounds we need while dealing with this menace. You must be familiar with the flower garden field effect, right? Nope. You'll need to find a way to take her on, and specifically, end the battle at that maximum stage of growth. Just in case you're missing it, I can pass you some data on the field effect. Okay. So it's four stages, right? I think they grow with a, with a certain seed. I'm not sure which one it is. But I think if you just give your mom the seed, it'll grow one stage. This was not an expected obstacle, but I'm afraid I'll have to count on you once more. Okay, uh, yeah, let's read the, the field effect just to see how you can grow the stage. So she wants it at max. Grows from stage one to five. Okay, uh, certain attacks grow one stage. I don't, I mean, I could use, I do have the TM for Rain Dance and Sunny Day, so I could use those. 
Wait, these abilities grow the field on state one stage on switching. Oh, okay. Um, cut nexus are reduced by one stage. Activate certain abilities. Um. Grass attacks get a boost. Bug attacks get a boost. Okay, here it is. Synthetic Seed. Yeah. Boost special defense, applies ingrain to the user, and makes the field grow by one stage. Oh boy. This is going to be tough, because not only do we have to win the battle, we got to win the battle while making sure the field is uh, at stage 5. I guess we can just give it a go and see how it... I'm assuming Crodberry is going to be using attacks that like lower the stage. Let's just give it a go and see what happens. Fire, Scourge, and Dung Water. I'll burn this devil house to oblivion and back again, no matter how many times it takes. Oh boy. Herodon Crawberry. I missed. Lovely. Oh my god. Wait, you hit a you hit a 30 accuracy fisher? No way did you just hit that, dude. There is no way you just hit a 30 accuracy fissure. I don't believe it. I can't believe it. How? How on earth did you just hit that? That's crazy. change the feel. It's not going to grow while it's in grassy terrain. Oh, that's not good. And the terrain's back to normal. So it goes all the way back to one stage if you change the terrain. Oh, man. No matter how many miserable times I, it takes, I swear on Seacrest's soul that I will purge this unholy cesspool of its filth once and for all. I refuse to be defeated. Yeah, okay, so we, we have to end it on the max stage. At least we get our team healed afterwards. Okay. Alright, uh, I'll see you guys when we, uh, when we win this battle on max stage, I guess. good is that maxed there we've got the level of growth we needed well 
What? What happened to Crodberry? Did she just? Did she... what? <laughs> no, on second thought, I'm not gonna ask any more questions about anything that just transpired. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Eve? Eve, are you okay? I heard that noise. What happened? No, everything's okay. There's no need for concern. Weren't you gonna wait? Weren't you gonna be waiting elsewhere? I was worried, okay? Oh, hi there, cuties. They're really okay. No mutations, no restraints, no harm. That Flora girl had some decent theories. I'm sure she has a bright future ahead of her. Though personally, I'm surprised the Shaman haven't just wandered off. Maybe they know we need their help. Thank you all for your support. So, you seem better. I'm sorry for our, how I reacted before. I was thinking about it, and I realized that maybe the thing I'm most uncomfortable with is having you do all the work for me. I know what happens to me affects you too, but this is my body. And I don't want to have to just sit around and be saved by you, by you all the time. So, I've decided that I'm not going to accept any cure you make. Uh, uh what? <laughs> I'm going to make it myself. Ah. You can show me how, and you can help. But I'm going to be the one to actually make it. I'm going to cure myself. Okay? Hmm. It hasn't ever... It hasn't even been that long since we were separated. But you really have grown up fast. Understood. I'll teach you everything. The shaman have already done the have already done their part. Let's let them go and then we can begin. This may take some time though. That's okay. I think, soon, I'll have all the time in the world. So am I still needed or? We're gonna be breaking down the petals to isolate this chemical compound. You mean I'm gonna be breaking them down. You can supervise, but I'm doing this myself. Yes, of course. I remember some of this stuff from when we were stuck together, but it makes more sense now. How did you ever learn all this stuff yourself? The same way anyone learns anything, I suppose. Lots of study, practice, and time. Lots of making mistakes. And lots of reason to learn its to learn it properly as fast as possible. Hmm. Hello, Shaman. So I guess we're just done here. They're gonna be they're gonna stay here working on this. We got the shaman. Let's uh let's head back. Wow, did you just make that windy old bag explode? I mean, like, sure, all this wholesome niceness is enough to make your heart sore. But I'm pretty sure if this sticky, or this sickly, sweet, positively... I'm pretty sure if this sickly, sweet positivity goes on any further, mine is going to jettison straight from my rib cage and leave me bleeding out on the ground. Kind of like that old lady. I mean, speaking of heart soaring, I think I can see hers shooting off into the void from here. You know you basically just killed someone, right? Are you really going to try and rationalize around that just because she yelled at you once or twice? But it's not like I meant for that to happen. 
I didn't have a choice. You're being unfair. Tell yourself that if you want. But you definitely had a choice. You didn't have to be Crodberry like that. No one was making you finish the quest. You just decided it was worth it because you liked one person better than the other. But what's wrong with that? Everyone does it. If no one was willing to make sacrifices, we'd all still be banging flint on stone in a cave somewhere. So don't worry, I understand. I'm on your side here, obviously. After all, who do you think made this world to even have enough things for a cure in the first place? Maybe I wanted to save Lumi, or maybe I wanted to save Lumi too. Anna never did that. You're welcome. It's kind of interesting how it's this whole Lynn versus Anna thing. I know we're on the uh, the Lynn route, right? Is that what it's called? I don't know, but uh. Anyway, let's uh let's head back.